guys! So, first thing I want to start off by saying, yes, I am in Harry Potter Gryffindor merchandise. And if you guys don't know, I'm literally obsessed with these books. Look, this is just such a great book. Wingardium Leviosa. And half of you guys are like, what is she saying? They are spells from Harry Potter. Expecto Patronum! <laughs> I should probably get to the actual video. Hey guys, so I'm in Honey Dukes at Universal Studios Hollywood, so I'm gonna show you around the store. These things are eggs. Exploding bonbons, caramel cobwebs, so we have fudge flies, chocolate caldron. Wow, what's that, Mom? Look at this white chocolate flavor and skull. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, did not try any of the candy in the store, but I did try butterbeer. Um, and let me just tell you, it's like the best drink I've ever had. Um, I tried the frozen butterbeer and the regular. Um, the frozen was probably my favorite. Um, I don't know, it was just like an ice cream slushy type taste. It was a butterscotch drink and it was just really good. The regular was more of a soda, but it was, they were both amazing, like butterscotch chasing sodas. Next thing I'm going to show you guys is some merchandise they have at Harry Potter World Hollywood. Um, it is pretty expensive, but honestly, it is so worth it. Okay, we are in one of the stores in Diagon Alley, and there's a bunch of like really cool Gryffindor stuff. So I want to mention a few things to you guys. If you go to Universal Studios Hollywood and you're a big Harry Potter fan, um, I have this map right here and the Harry Potter stuff is all on the top. So there's two rides in Universal Studios Hollywood and the Harry Potter land. Um, and one of them is Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey. This is like an interactive kind of ride. Um, you know, lots of uh, TV screens and you feel like you're flying on broomsticks and stuff like that. It's kind of fun for the family. Um, the next ride is Fight of the Hippogriff. Or Hippogriff, however you say it. Um, this is like a family friendly roller coaster. Me and my mom went on it like two times. It's not jerky. Little kids can go on it. It's really fun. Um, and another thing you need to do is Ollivander's wand shop experience. Even if you don't get chosen, it's still really cool. The wand shop looks just like it did in the movie. You pick one, um, usually a child from each group that goes in to get their wand chosen. <laughs> Surprisingly, I was chosen. I mean, it was my birthday, so they probably were like, oh, let's make her a day. So, um, here are some pictures of me, you know, I get to try out wands, you know, knock the bookshelves and over, stuff like that over, um, and, you know, then I got, um, my, uh, I got my wand chosen. The thing about the wands, um, I know the wands are, like, super cool at Ollivander's, um, and those are all original. So those are ones you can only buy in the park. So if you want a completely original wand, 
um, buy it at the park. You can't get it anywhere else. But if you want a replica, say Hermione, Harry, Ron's wand, don't buy it at the park. Um, they were selling those wands for $43, really expensive. I got this one, it's a collector's item. It's the exact one that they had at the park and with a coupon I got it for $22 at Barnes & Noble. So definitely something to think about. Me and my family also ate at a restaurant called Three Broomsticks in Harry Potter Land. It is probably the best restaurant in Universal Studios. It's really good. The food and me is really good. I have some pictures of me and my family going there. So if you want a good place to eat, Three Broomsticks is definitely where you should go. So after we did Harry Potter Land, we went and did the studio tour. Now the studio tour is definitely something you want to do when you're there because it gives you an entire tour it's a it's an hour long but it shows you all the movie sets they use like for real film I have a video to show you guys of one of the experiences when you're on this I guess you could call it a ride fire effects and things like that when you're on the ride. We're gonna need a bigger tramp. I also wanted to tell you guys that if you go on your birthday like I did, they will give you special treatment. I was wearing this huge birthday pin and they gave me a birthday pin. Um, I was wished happy birthday wherever I went and a lot of the employees let me cut the line. I got to skip some really long lines and it was really awesome. So just something to keep in mind. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. I know this isn't my normal video, so if you stay to the end, thank you. Um, I really appreciate it. I know I probably wasn't doing a lot of stupid stuff like I was in the past videos, but I really wanted to show you guys my trip to Universal. It was so much fun and if you ever go, I hope you go to Harry Potter Land because it is awesome. See you guys.